Let's take a look to the patch notes, see what's going on in the next split. New mode, no cards. All right, so this is basically a new mode of Battle Royale, which is around collecting evil points and objectives around the map. Every round, five squads with the lowest points will get eliminated. And after three rounds, basically everyone is going to be eliminated because of the low points. Only five squads will stay and they okay. will battle between themselves. Interesting game mode. Can't wait to play it. Can't wait to see what happens. Yeah, maybe, you know, I'm gonna play it for like once, twice, and then you're like, oh, this trash. Let me go back to ranked and lose my mind again. Okay. Yeah, this game mode is gonna bring um, challenges. So, yeah. Okay. These skins look not too bad, to be honest. Bro, these skins on E District, they're gonna like blend with the uh, environment so well, but with the new like legend highlight on the enemies, I guess it doesn't matter. But yeah, this Bangalore skin looks fire, though. Yeah, good skins overall. Okay, the Kraber skin looks nice, I think. But yeah, no one cares about weapon skins, right? Oh, a new Mozambique skin, that like something. This is the new heirloom, I guess? Is this universal? I think this is the new universal heirloom, bro. Yeah, it has to be. Oh my god. That animation up top, dude. Is this like designable up top? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Uh, yeah, reward shop. Might buy the Bangalore skin, not gonna lie, dude. This is amazing. Uh, balance updates, Mozambique. Oh, gold weapon rotation, bro. Holy Mozambique in gold weapon rotation. Bro, they needed to nerf it, not buff it more like this. Hello? Eva 8, okay. Oh, flatline. Ooh, that's that's gonna be interesting, bro. Gold weapon rotation is so interesting. Uh, gameplay uh, loot beans. Now they have uh, announcer voice line when loot beans reset. This is really good. Yeah, and they reduced like the loot spawn on the loot beans. That's that's much needed. Mythic loot beans will roll large healing item more consistently. This is interesting as well. So you get extra stacked from mythic loot beans. Okay, so basically they nerfed gold beans and buffed mythic beans. This one is interesting. Havoc is no more with a turbocharger. That's crazy. That's crazy. They should buff the damage at least then. I mean, still overpowered, to be honest, as a secondary. It's just the fact that Akimbo right now is so OP that you can't use any other weapon. But if Akimbo gets nerfed, the Havoc is going to shine again, for sure, dude. Even though with no turbo. They nerfed 99. Improved recoil, okay. Uh, it's a buff for PC players, the recoil thing. Because control players don't need to control any recoil anyway. But I'd say this is a nerf overall. This one is interesting. Ammo that spawns with a weapon will now be always a single brick, but with twice the ammo, this one is so interesting. So we got like more space inside the loot bins for other stuff. This is good. Reduce spawn. No one, I feel like I didn't see much of the gun shield hop up around. Maybe because no one used the weapons that this hop up goes for, but yeah, we'll see. Ultimate Accelerant is now purple. Okay, this one is interesting. Increased movement speed while using it. Okay, so a buff nerf kind of to the alt XL. We will see like more people carrying more alt XLs around. They hard cap the max scan of the fuse area. So I think the evac thing, like the evac bang smoke and fuse alt is gone now. Nerf to Revenant, finally, bro. Reduced shield health to 50. Nice, big. It's like a white shield now instead of a purple. Activation time doubled. What does this mean? Wait, what? So your ultimate lasts for for longer? Bro, come on. You can just keep getting knocks over and over. I don't know. I, I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know. It's crazy. Okay, Valkyrie with big, 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 big patch notes. Seems interesting. Now a recon legend. Okay, so... Access to beacons. We might see Valkyrie in LGS again. Who knows? Full tank upgrade now includes a 50% reduction in refuel. Delay to 4 seconds was 8. Okay, this one is good. So basically when your jetpack empties, you just charge it again fast. Gain threat vision while jetpacking. What? Bro. <laughs> sure. Until fit hits the ground zip line. Bro, holy... Okay, Valkyrie is going back, guys. I've seen a lot. I don't know what's going on. Move slow, stun the nation increased by 50. Okay, Valkyrie is definitely coming back. Yeah, definitely, bro. Like, there is no doubt about it. They just buffed her to the sky, man. 
سي وات اي ديد ذير فالكيري سكاي اوكي اني مول اتاك رينج ديكريست باي 20 كان هيت انيميز لوتار كلاوزر برو بليز ستوب بافين هير مور هولي ماكس ميسايل ترافل تايم ناو فور سكند واز برو وات برو وات ذي جاست بافت هير برو تو ذا يو نو سكاي اي ديستريكت اولمبيس كينجز كانيون نو واي مان اي هايت اون ثري ديس موب سايدز كينجز كانيون اي ديستريكت اي مين انا بروكن مون اي جاس بات برو اي ميس وورلدز ارج اوريدي كوم اون دوز ار ايترن نايس Yeah, the new mode is gonna be nice. For the mixtape, it's gonna be TDM, Control, Garan, but who cares? It's the usual. Okay, ranked. Ranked trample should add to the existing ranked experience, not be a substitute. Okay. <clears throat> so I guess ranked trample is going back. Yeah, seems like ranked trample is going back. Some back fixes. You can't EMP while recalling your drone now. I mean, it used to be an annoying trick when you can't even shoot the drone and you get EMP'd. Not a big thing though, but yeah, still, still a good fix. Newcastle Swift Shield upgrade now works as intended. Was it like bad or... Okay, so I think it's a buff kind of. Emergency power upgrade will now affect teammates and all ticks. Okay, this one is good for Watson. Solved issue with health regen in mixtape. Yay, this was so annoying. Okay, never mind. Uh, quality of life. Valkyrie can now cancel heart attack by melee punching. Thank you, game. I did the ability to manage your inventory while healing and ziplining. So you can heal and go into your inventory and, or you can zipline and go into your inventory. Nice. A district. Let's go. This was annoying. Yeah. Yeah. There are some walls that you can see like behind, but you can't climb over. This one is good. North side of the map. That's like, yeah, more survey beacons. Let's go. Like make the map full of survey beacons, please. Ground loot. 100 loot bins have been added to the map. Good. I have ground loot, nice. Buses now have ground loot, that's nice. Various buildings have had their ground loot slightly increased, nice. Reduce the amount of possible high tier loot spawning at Lotus. I didn't even realize this map was stacked with loot. Located Blossom, Driver's Crafter to the far west side. Okay, I guess. Resolved a number of additional bugs and rat spots. If there is only thing I have to say is that E District is full of rat spots. Like every corner is a rat spot. If you don't have a scan legend or a legend that can access beacons, it's hell. Especially with Crypto and his ability to go invisible. It's crazy. Graphic fixes. Nice. That's really good. Hope that fixes some issues for some people. So more loot, basically. Yeah, and uh, that's it for the, the update. I went through the patch notes so you guys don't have to. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you guys in the next one. Peace.